YouTube, it is me, Nikki. This video is going to be a story time video, and as you can see in the title below, it's about when I went to jail. If you guys are not interested in watching this video, please exit and watch another video down below. Um, first of all, I would like to give a shout out to shopmissade.com. And no, this is not a sponsored <laughs> video or anything like that. I just want to say I love this three piece set that I got from shopmissade.com and it was a dollar so I will put their link down below so you guys can go check them out and again this is not a sponsored video I'm not getting paid to say that I just figured you, you ladies will like to know about some inexpensive cute jewelry and all three pieces were this was a three piece set and it was a dollar just saying but any home let's get back to the video again this is a story time video about when I went to jail and yes I went to jail um, this happened about when I was like 19, 20 years old. I've always had issues with this girl since he's like little and problems escalated. Let's just leave it like that. We went to court on a Thursday and everything was settled. Everything was good. Blah, 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 blah. Well, Friday, um, like the following Friday, mid afternoon, um, I get a knock at the door. So, at my mother's house, there's a window by the door and there's a peek hole and blah, blah. So, I look outside the door, there's a whole bunch of cops. And I'm not just saying just cops standing outside. They had their guns drawn. They It was more than one and it was a bunch of them. So, I'm like, what the hell is going on? And my mom lives in a project, so I'm thinking they have the wrong address, the wrong everything. So, again, they knock on the door and mind you, I'm like in house clothes, like a t-shirt. I was pregnant and some sweats and my hair was wild so um i answered the door they was like is nicole here and me being stupid i was like yeah it's just me blah 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 and they was like we're here to arrest you we have a warrant for your arrest i'm like what what like shocked in my head i'm like what the fuck did i do i'm a good girl i don't do nothing i don't break the law i don't do nothing uh, <laughs> so they was explaining to me that i have a warrant for my arrest because i defaulted i did not go to court the following day and i'm sitting there with the officer explaining them i did go to the court the other girl was late. They defaulted her, um, but I went to court. And because they wouldn't let me leave the doorway to go get paperwork, well, one officer was like, go get your paperwork. The mean officer, because it was a mean one, he was like, no, you guys sit right here, and we're here to arrest you. And then I'm all, like, freaking out. I'm crying because I'm pregnant. I don't want to go to jail. There's so many dogs and cops around, like I darn killed someone or something happened. And mind you, like I said, my mom lives in the projects and you know in the projects or any neighborhood, people see lights, they see sirens, they coming out their house. Now mind you, there's dogs, cops with their guns drawn, so now everybody was outside on my mom's block. Um... So the officer was like, yeah, we got to arrest you. And I'm freaking out and crying, like I said, like tears shaking, everything. My mom has a dog. He's barking, barking in the background because he don't like cops. And um, the, the other officer's like, you need to come out. We're going to shoot the dog. We're going to shoot the dog. And I'm all like, please don't shoot the dog. In my head, I was like, shoot me. Don't shoot the dog. My mom will kill me anyways. But not literally shoot me. But um, yeah, so they're trying to figure it out on the computer. On one computer, it said, yes, I had a default warrant. When they called, they was like, no, I don't have a default warrant. So the officer, one officer was like, well, we'll just let it go and say it was a mix-up. The other officer was like, no, it's in the computer. We need to book her, blah, 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 blah. And mind you, I'm sorry. I'm not going to edit this. Um, blah, 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 blah. Like, and I'm freaking out crying and so now they come to a conclusion with the mean officer the good officer that they're gonna arrest me <sighs> I was crying I'm pregnant they eat that day <laughs> I was hungry I was pissed off um so I asked to call my mom one officer was like no one officer was like yeah and then they gave they let me call my mom and I told my mama do not hang up the phone I'm being arrested because I was always playing jokes on my mom and I didn't want her to hang up on me so I was like this is not a joke I'm going to jail so she was freaking out there I'm going outside afro looking all cray cray and one officer was all like we can't like handcuff her because she's pregnant like 
one and then the officer was like, yeah, we're going to handcuff you. Blah, 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 blah. They're sitting there doing their thing. But finally, they walked me to the car. They let me walk to the car unhandcuffed. Um, so it could look like maybe there was an emergency or something. So people didn't know I was getting arrested. But once I got to the car, he like closed the door a little bit and then he handcuffed me. Going to the jail. Now I'm getting booked. They couldn't get my fingerprints. Because I was crying, I was nervous, I was sweating. They could only get like three on this finger and my pinky and my thumb on this hand. They was finally like, whatever. Well, book her like that. So now it's coming to booking. Because I am a female, they cannot like physically search me. Like they cannot pat me down or strip search me, whatever they do. Because I am a female. There is no female officers in the jail. There is none on duty. So what they had me do was like bend over, like bend over, shake out my shirt. They had me unstrap my bra, but keep it on, make sure nothing was in there. They took my shoelaces. I had sweatpants on, so they basically had me run my fingers around my waist, shake them out, and sort of make sure I had no weapons or anything. My hair was already in the bush, looking cray cray. They just had me bend over, shake out my hair, make sure nothing was in there. Blahzy blah. So I'm there now. Now. I went to four, not one, not two, three, but four different jails, four different holding cells. None of these, I was I was never fed. I was never give, given water. I asked. They didn't give me nothing. I was in the uh, one jail, prison jail, whatever you want to call it, holding cell. I was in there with a murderer um, who killed her husband and her uncle. I was in there with people who just, I was in there with some violent people. I'm freaking out. And now I'm in there Friday. I'm in there for the whole weekend because, one, the bail bonds person wasn't around, whatever. My bail, mind you, was only $10. I couldn't, I wasn't allowed to bail myself out even though I had money on me. My mom couldn't get to the jail where I was to bail me out. So I'm there for the whole weekend. I did not eat. I did not sleep. I, I peed. Um, but I did not eat. I did not sleep for those days. I was up all those days, um, because I was too scared to sleep. Um, the first day I was in there with other prisoners, whatever you want to call them. But the second day I was, they moved me to a different jail. I was by myself in my own holding cell once they realized I was pregnant. Not that you couldn't tell because my stomach was all big, but that's a whole nother story. Um, so... Once I got to the cell that I was by myself, you would think I would sleep. No, I was freaking out. I'm in jail. I'm pregnant. No, I'm not sleeping. I'm not putting my head. I'm not sitting on anything. I stood and paced the whole weekend. Paced. Because this, these places are dirty. They are not clean. They are not clean. There's piss. There's shit. There was blood everywhere. It stunk. It's so I'm not putting my tushy on anything. I'm not touching anything. No, no, no. Even if I wasn't pregnant. No, no, no. It was nasty. No. Um, so Monday comes along. We're going to court and I'm happy. I'm like, yes, I can go. I got this fucking place. Um, mind you, I still look, I look crazy. My hair was crazy. Finally, they see my lawyer this from the previous court before I got arrested. Walked by. I was like, there he is. There he is. That's the lawyer that had me. He knows. He knows. I was screaming. And I was like, that's him. And then the lawyer comes like, what is she doing in here? Why is she in here going off on the um, cops and saying stuff saying, why is she shackled? Why is she this? Why is she that? She's pregnant. She can't this, 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 that. So I was the first case called. Thank you, Jesus. They said, oh, it's a mistake. Blah, blah. You can go home. Blah, blah, blah. My mom, I ran her to the McDonald's. I didn't care what I looked like. I ran her to the McDonald's. I ate my food, her food. I wanted the people's next to me food. I wanted your food, their food, everyone's food. I was so damn hungry. And then everything was squashed. And I went to jail for no reason for someone else's BS. Um, I could have sued. Well, my mom could have sued or we could have sued. But at that point... I didn't care. I wasn't hurt. I wasn't injured. I was hungry, but I wasn't hurt. I wasn't injured or anything like that. And y'all all know if you go against the state, the police department, it will take you a lifetime to get any money. And where I wasn't hurt or anything, I didn't care. I just wanted to eat and go home. When I After we ate, I went home. I showered for like two hours. 
took a nap, got back up and showered again because I felt so dirty. But that is my story time video. I went to jail for someone else's BS. But everything worked out. And my baby boy is born healthy and great. Nothing was wrong. And that's when I was pregnant with my oldest, just for you guys to know. But that was my story time video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And again, I hope you guys enjoy the new lighting and everything and videos that I will be bringing you will be more better and yay! If you guys enjoyed this story time video and would like more story time videos, just leave a comment down below. Please check out all my social media. All my social media will be linked down below. I also link shopmissade.com just so you guys can go check out some jewelry. Like I said, this three piece set was a dollar and it's so cute. But again, um, disclaimer, I am not affiliated with shopmissade.com. Wish I was. I am not sponsored by them. Wish I was. Everything I bought was with my own money. But I just wanted to give them a shout out because the set is so cute. But again, if you want more story time videos, just hit the link down below. Hit the leave a comment down below. Check out all my social media because like I said before, when I'm not here on YouTube, I'm Instagramming, I'm Snapchatting, I'm Twitter Twittering. <laughs> I'm on Twitter. I'm on Snapchat. I'm on all that. So just check out one of my links down below, leave a comment down below, and if you're new to my channel, hi! And to everybody else, thank you for staying connected with me, and again, hit that notification bell so you can be updated on my channel. I will see you guys in the next one.